Hey, it's me, Zanov, and welcome back to the Living Skyrim 4 playthrough. How are we doing, guys? I'm doing fantastic myself. I missed my last recording session, so I've got the faintest idea of what's going on. Look at these textures. I've got the faintest idea of what's going on, but I can't quite remember. I think they were talking about something, and I think this has got... I believe this has got to do with something about the old guy in the... Uh, well, not the old guy, but the dude at Windhelm? I can't quite remember. Hopefully I pick up the pieces. And she just turned to me and then I left. He's an uncle. I think he's an uncle to someone. I think he's an uncle to the dude in Windhelm. Yeah, I think that's where we're at, but I can't remember anything to do with the quest. Hello. Stranger. You look like the adventurer. I have been on many a quest and I will be on many more. To help us save a friend who might be in danger. Fight well and the job will pay well. Do you think you're up for it? I'm always up for it, Benild. Uh, what am I up for? What I am up for is none of well. That's no, we don't need to be so that we don't need to be so mean. Uh, I f I fight well. You better make sure you keep your end of the bargain. I'm scrawny, cowardly, and weak, but I come cheap and I can distract your foes. Uh, I felt I fight well enough, Sarah. Just tell me where and when. Uh, let's go with this. I fight I fight well. You better make sure you keep your end of the bargain. Oh, we will. You may not be aware of this, but my friend here is an heir to a substantially large fortune. Mm, good. We want to do our best to stay on his good side. Uh-huh. Uh, as a bodyguard, I need to know what kind of trouble you're expecting to find. What makes you think your friend is in danger? All right, I'll be your bodyguard. Where are we headed? Yeah, um, where's that quintessentially inny smell? Lucian. Lucian, please. Throw it in the Lucian. Lucian, please. Okay, um... Uh, let's go with this. You ask a lot of questions for a hireling. All you need to know is that she is, or else we wouldn't be paying you. Yeah, but like, who am I going to expend? Who am I expecting to come after me? That would kind of affect. I would think in a real situation that would affect how I armor up and whatnot. But sure, keep your secrets. As a bodyguard, I need to know what kind of trouble you're expect. Yeah, exactly. We aren't fighting saber cats, if that's what you're asking. Whoever it is walks on two legs, eats, and empties its bowels just like us. More importantly. It bleeds like us. That should be enough to keep your tunic dry. Oh, why all the click and dagger? Just tell me. <laughs> all right, I'll be your bodyguard. Where are we headed? Good. A couple of well-placed swords will make things, as your ilk are fond of saying, right as Rain's hand. The place she's hiding out is a cave called Pure Water Run, just outside of Markarth. We'll meet you there. We haven't been to Markarth yet. Hmm. Meet Vathim and Benild at Pure Water Run. Okay, I'm going to talk to you. Excuse me, but I don't talk to the hell. My goodness. My goodness. I'm not liking you guys. Excuse me. All right. But I don't talk to the hell. Is that so? I'm just so, oh, so tempted to quick save and kill him, but fine. Fine. All right, let's go. Um... Hmm. Hello there. Are you finding it? Are you finding it rather troublesome pathing your way out of here? Honey pots, nice. Gosh, I love these inns now. We need a good rumor or two. I think I can oblige. Skyrim is just such a nice place to run around in now. All right, let's. Uh, oh, and these loading screens. He knows the names of the naming. He knows the weight of the weight and the waiting. He enters every star and moon. He shines through their shadows. Hey, I actually got to read a loading screen. How's about that? All right, and now there's beautiful solitude. I swear, I could just, I could literally just walk around. I could just walk around and enjoy the sights. Uh, that robe. Are you a wizard? Is that an elf kid? That's an elf kid. We have elf kids. I won't see Rob here anymore. But he wouldn't tell me why not. Ooh, he's a head short of a uh, head short of a uh, a head short of a man, I would say. All right, let's, uh, okay, so we've got elf kids. I, I haven't even seen that yet. Elf kids, I wonder if there's kids of other races, like Argonian or Khajiit. I would suspect that would be pretty hard to put in, though. I would think. And we're not in survival mode, so I don't need to run around. Uh, okay, where are we going? We are meeting them just outside Markarth. There's Ark and Thams. So many map markers now. All right. Let's, uh, let's, uh, let's, uh, let's, uh, let's, uh, hmm. Yeah, let's just catch a carriage from Solitude, fine. It's all good. No need to, like, fast travel to it. I love how this all looks now. 
I'm going to say it over and over again. We're going to get to... I don't know, what episode are we up to now? I think this is episode... Episode 32? Episode 33? Something like that. We're around that spot, and I I think we're going to get through an entire playthrough, because where I just... and I, Like, even little things, where that, that, that wheel has always been hovering, and it's just been fixed. Um, yeah, I think we're going to get... We're going to get... I don't know if I'll ever stop saying how beautiful it is. It is. It's beautiful, but you're putting on the wrong stinking helmet, the wrong, the wrong boots. Okay. All right. Thea, uh, I'd like to hire your carriage. Where do you want to go? Please take me. Ooh, uh, the Reach. Going straight through, or did you want to stop somewhere along the way? I love this too. Uh, take me straight to Marker. Drop me off at Carthwaston. Drop me off at Old Froldan. Drop me off at Soldiers Sinkhole. Mark Arth. We'll just go straight to Mark Arth. Okay. Yep. Didn't mean... What? Ah, oh, so holding E does that as well. So if I just press L, that's fine. And if I hold E, it also... Ah, I see. Okay. Jump on. Let's head out. Ever been to Mark Arth? Some say it was built by the dwarves. I don't believe a word of it. You are a fool. You are a fool, Thea. Every time that happens, I always get so so anxious. I'm like, ooh, are we uh, are we about to bug out? Are we not to? Are we about to not get into a loading screen? And something's Yo. happening. Oh my goodness! Lost Valley Bull Walk. Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay. This is this is different. Okay. Oh my god. Oh. Am I dead? Did I die? Wow, okay. Alright. Well, we're gonna be all the way back here. Right, let's just skip through this real quick. Yep, 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 yep. Um, um, okay, let's go. Okay, alright, I'll be your bodyguard. Let's do it. Awesome source, I'll see you there. Uh huh. Cool. Alright, well, there's a lesson in that. Let's save before traveling, because that was rather... that was rather inconvenient. But the outside of Markarth looks completely different. I was... I was pretty... I was pretty immediately lost. I had no idea where I was. Okay. So we'll expect that, and I'm gonna be sure to save before I jump on that... before I jump on that carriage. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, I'm kinda hoping that whole mammoth thing doesn't happen again. That just seems like a really good way for people to die that I don't want to die. Seems like a this seems like a really good way for that to happen. I wish there was a option in the uh, in the mod menu to just kind of try and make a lot of the people invincible instead of having them die all the time. Um, is there? I don't know. I didn't see one. I didn't see one. And I've been meaning to check. Do I have? No. I pr I need to get fast healing. I need to get fast healing because this just keeps draining my magicka and I think that's the only way around it in the smart cast menu. So we're gonna have to do that. Ooh, I almost didn't save. I almost didn't save. Alright, saving progress. Bada bing bada boom. Hello there. Need something? Yeah, I'd like to hire your carriage. Where do you want to go? Take me to the reach. Going straight through or did you want to Going straight through, my boy. Alright, let's go. If you don't mind a piece of advice, stay out of trouble in Markar. Toss you in the Sydney mine and you'll never get out. Indeed, indeed. Alright, also need to behave. What is this? What a more immersive way to fast travel? Find or make the void gate spell. Okay. okay. Alright, we're gonna have to think of think on that. Alright, seems like this is kind of just happening. Um Alright, alright, this is gonna be interesting for sure. Let's hope nobody dies. I think there must be somebody with a arrow bow and arrow somewhere. Level 40, my goodness. Alright. Okay, somebody died. Hopefully that was just a guard. Alright. 139. Alright, we're gonna be here for a while. <laughs> we are gonna be here for a long while. Hopefully he can't get me. Oh boy. Alright team. I guess this one's on me. Alright. This outside is looking very different. Looks very not... Ooh. Uh, looks very not conducive of having this event happen, I would say. But I like it. I like it regardless. 
very, very cool. So there's this thing that obviously the Forsworn have tamed, this mammoth. And there was an assault leader. And I'm guessing it's just the assault leader. Oh no, the, okay, there's an archer somewhere. Or something. There's a red, oh no, the red dot over there got taken care of. Alright. Well, I'm happy. I'm happy. So long as this, as long as this mammoth isn't killing anyone, I'm happy. I want people to stay alive. I want people to stay alive. Gosh, this is taking a while. You're a strong boy, I'll give you that. You're a strong boy. Alright. It's good that you're stuck though. This could be, this could be bad. You know what? Let's level up. Let's do it. Let's go Magicka. Oh, and let's go Health. I died pretty easy there. Alright, level 14. We're looking good. By the luck of the nine, I have gained an additional perk point. That's always good. Alright, let's uh let's change up our let's change up our spells. Ooh. Storm Monarch. Do I have enough for this? I don't even know if I have enough of these yet, but golly oh gosh, do I want to? Um We'll try it, we'll try it after all this. I'm not even distraction, what am I doing? Let's go thun oh what's shocking touch? Uh that doesn't look yeah, that's not worth it. That's not worth getting that close to the mammoth. Let's do this. Oh, I don't have enough for a jewel cast. Gotcha. Headshot. All right. Ooh, cool. Jeepers. All right. Hello. Give me that. Give me, you've got four tusks? I guess, I guess you do. I guess you actually do. Makes sense. Uh, mammoth. Oh, that's a lot of mammoth steak. So I'm guessing they're 0.5 each. And there we go. Cannot run. I uh, wasn't paying attention. All right. No, 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 no. We're, we're discontinuing that. I need to trade some things with you. Let us see what we have. Um. Ah, oh, put on the glass helmet for goodness' sake, in a go. Uh. Let's give you them. I'm still over by a bit. Let's give you them. Don't put them on, please. Why am I carrying these? I thought I got rid of them. Give you them. Give you them. We'll give you Serenity, the Baltimore Dagger, the Daedric Mace. You're welcome. You're welcome. Nordic Mace, Daedric Battle Axe. You're welcome. Orcs Battle Axe. You're welcome. I oh, I forgot I had all them. No wonder I'm being weighed down. All right. Um. It, all right. So look at that Markarth guard armor. I love it. Markart Gauntlets. A little bit of a spelling error there. Right, right. Yeah, Markart. Markart. <laughs> bit of a spelling error, but that's fine. That's forgivable. Damage health poison recipe. I don't need three of them, but I guess I'll take them. I guess I can sell them. Gold necklace of minor... Ooh, let's have a look at these. Uh, scaled braces of minor champion. Yeah. Scaled boots of minor... Yeah. Uh, necklace of... Yeah. And ring... Yeah. And the steel battle of burning... And you'll notice all those other enchantments had like a tick next to them, which means we knew the enchantments. So that's actually going to make it very handy, uh, kind of deciding between stuff I'll keep picking up. I'll probably pick up most enchanted things just because, you know, good for selling. Um, and now begins the process of kind of running around and hoping uh, no civilians died. Are you the one who killed me? Are you the one who killed me last time? I would think you are. Uh, you probably just hit me from a hail. It was a hail mary hit from all the way away. Look at this outside. I haven't even. I haven't even taken it in yet. I have not even taken it. Let's let's run to the front. Let's run to the front and let's uh, let's approach Markarth as it were. You know, as, as if we had run here. All right. And let's also kind of get rid of this this dreary look. I want to. I want to see what Markarth is looking like here. So we'll go 12, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. We'll go 10. Around about 10 o'clock, 10 in the morning. All right. Raining's gone. Oh. Oh. Look at all the extra details everywhere. You gotta love it. You gotta love it. Whoa. That's a Khajiit kid. That's a Khajiit kid, isn't it? That is. Khajiit kids are a thing. Wow, look at that road. Hello, Ranik. That is cool. There's Khajiit. Oh my goodness, there are Khajiit kids now. This, uh, this is awesome. All right. Um, Rissad, hello. It is a Kayla. strange sight. The white flakes that sometimes fall from the sky. Yeah. The longer we travel the roads of Skyrim, the more empty this land seems. 
Okay. Let's, uh, I was just looking around to see if any of the Khajiit looked, uh, super different, because I don't know if that, there's a certain mod that introduces, or at least introduces some of the different types of Khajiit that actually exist in the lore. And, um, I don't, I'm not sure, but I don't think it's, I don't think it's been implemented in this mod list. I believe it hasn't been, but it's still cool. And look at this, Salvius's farm has had a, has had a deal up, hasn't it? It didn't look like this before. I think it was just this building and maybe that, right? Okay, I'm liking it. I'm liking it. A bit of overflow from the well as well. Salvius's farmhouse. Okay, so we've got a whole... Alright. Okay, let's run up to Markarth now. That's the big... That's the big deal. That's the big deal thing. Just look at the scenery. Alright. Oh, <laughs> look at it. Look at it. My goodness. Wow, this is quite a bit more impressive and I would say indicative of like a, a Dwemer, a Dwemer, I don't know, living space in the overworld. Look at all this. Look at all these new people. Yes, a gore. Oh my, good. oh my goodness. All right, we have got... Oh, man. Oh, man, there's so many NPCs to talk now, it's overwhelming. To talk to now, it's overwhelming. Look at this. What is this? Look at this. Look at this stuff. Old Dan- Oh my goodness. I, I don't even know where to begin. I don't even know where to begin. It is just all so different. And just look at that. Just look- And who are you? Put on some clothes. Let's uh, let's drop a save here. Because I will most- Or well, well, first of all, I don't want to have to do that whole mammoth thing again. But I'll most likely be taking a thumbnail out here for sure. That's, that's just a given. Let's see if we can get some nice lighting going. Let's uh... Let's go about there. We'll, we'll go there. See if we get. Ah, oh, well, that was. That's not what I wanted. All right. Let's get rid of this rain again. I want some nice afternoon yeah. light. I'd like you to have this as a token of my friendship. Okay. I like that you do these things, Fandle. I just don't like that they usually put me in an over, over encumbered state. Look at this. What? Oh man. All right. Uh. Okay. Maybe one more hour. I really want to get that pink sky. Ah, it doesn't look like it can happen here. Okay, Pro probably all the mountainous stuff. All right, let's wait until five, six, seven, eight, nine. We'll wait for it to be a fresh day. Oh, and it's raining. <laughs> all right, let's do that. Let's go. Skip the rain. Skip the rain. Skip the and it's raining again. All right. Skip the rain. Skip the rain. Skip the rain. Nice. All right. Now let's begin the day. Alright, look at all of it. Look at all of it. Markarth East Empire Company. Alright, this is a big boy as well. This assault leader. Um, what is this? What is all of this? Where does this... Is this like a different... No, old temple. It's just a completely new area. Cool. I hope there are like also quests associated with going into these places. All right, because because like I just I don't even know if it's, if I'm gonna be able to force myself to go into them to check them all out. Like there'll just be too much I would miss. I hope there's quests that eventually take us into these places. Markarth Clockwork Terminus. Oh, see just stuff like that where that's obviously a completely different mod, but it's been patched in. Because that's the uh, that's for the um, the Clockwork Tower thing. So you'd. You'd, uh, you'd spawn there and then come out and then be at Markarth. All right, let's run on in and get our shocky shockies ready for what is about to happen. Man. This is Markarth, Traveler. Safe Look at it. Safe for City in the Reach. I, I think that statement's going to be challenged as soon as I walk through that door. Okay, let's save. And shocky shockies ready. Look at that for a big grand opening. Alright, hopefully it's not super popular and there's a bunch of stuff on the way so I can still get to this guy nice and quick. Oh, right. No! Uh, is, is anybody going to stop him? How come I can't... Okay, so I couldn't lock onto him straight away like I wanted to. But he's going to be easy to kill. He's going to be easy to kill. Alright. That's what I gather from that. He took one shock and he died. Alright, so I can't lock onto him. That's why I was paused. I was waiting to try and lock onto him. That's not gonna be that's not gonna be something I can do. So I just gotta aim on target. I can't rely on the lock on like I have been. 
It's become a crutch now. <laughs> shock is out. Alright, alright, alright. One shock and you're gone, Waylon. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Let me go, let me go, let me go. Oh, he is hard to get at. He is so hard to get at now. He's hard to get at just specifically because it takes so long to, to actually come out of that black screen and start moving. Alright. Alright. I'm gonna I'm gonna give this another shot. If I don't get it, meh, it's not too it's not too bad. It's just my typical thing. I like to make sure people are alive. I just like to keep people alive. More characters, more dialogue, yada yada yada. You guys know the spiel at this point. Come on, come on. Got him. Got him. Oh yes. Oh, nice. So got a ring. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you guys got it under control, right? It wasn't me that did that. Alright, now look at this. Is that a safe in there? Ooh. What is this? What is all this? What is all this? <laughs> okay. Uh, Alright, uh, let's just close that, I reckon. Let's go hit it. Okay, well that makes sense. I was going to say, there's got to be something good in this hidden chest. He can't see me. He can't see me. If he can't see me, he can't get me. Alright, so as soon as I open this, I am going to need to press R to get in there. Alright, alright. I've got to, got to re-remember how sensitive this is. It is literally like the tiniest increments. The tiniest increments until we find that sweet spot. Oh. Boom. Nice. Alright. What have we got here? Eastern Dwemer Short Sword. Look at that. Alright. Silver Jewel Necklace. Yep. Eastern Dwemer Short Sword. Yep. And none of this is stealing? No worries. Flawless gun, eh? Yep. Sapphire. Yep. Steel ingot. I'll let you. I'm a charitable guy. I'll let you keep the steel ingot. And la di da di da, nothing to see here, Mr. Guard. Nothing to see here at all. Look at that, that's cool as. Look at that. They used to call the city Nichown Zell. Nichown Zell. Markarth does seem to roll off the tongue better, don't you think? That's why you're so good to have along, Lucy. And you've got little, 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 little drops of lore that's. Kids, kids, kids. You want to get out of the way, alright? Um. Yeah, just like you handled that whole situation, right? Oh, I forgot about you. Attacked right on the streets. Yeah. You all right? Did you see what happened? Um, I was right. Well, he didn't almost kill me. Um. I'd like you to have it. Yeah, I, I guess maybe he almost killed me. Yeah. I hope the eight give you more peace in the future. Thank you for the leather fandle. Oh, I think you dropped this. Some kind of note. Looks important. Okay. Do you know anything about the attack? Mm, no. I was just getting some fresh air. I had one too many pints of mead at the Silver Blood Inn. Mm-hmm. Fair enough. Um, is this your note? What does this mean? My note? No, that's yours. Must have fallen out of your pocket. All right, cool. Thank you, Altrius. We will continue until your quest reaches its end a bit later. Uh, let's discover all these things. I'm surprised that doesn't have a... I would think for sure this would have a, a little uh, icon on it. All right, let's discover all these. You get all the get all the uh, experience for it. Boom, boom, boom. Vinderal Hall. Gosh, there's a lot of quest markers. Oh, not quest markers, but question marks. Who are you? Oh, what is it? Well, you're new. Hello, Mariah. Do you bother everyone this much? Oh, jeez. Well, I don't want to talk to you either. See you later. <laughs> You're trying to tell us. Um. Hmm. Let's get a let's get a top view of Markarth. Oh, so this just the greenery and the trees now. Well, I love it. Uh, Temple of Debella. Where else? Where else? Okay, got a few more things over here. Don't die. Nice. Boom. All right, Markarth Forge. Oh. What is this? Uh, a nail? Is that what you call it? Oh, the goggles. Look how brittle the metal. You look like an orc so, forger. I just this is cool. The forge gets so hot and you thought. You thought what? You would skip a step, not heat the metal all the way through? Jesus. Now do it again. 
But <laughs> Are you T posing? Kind of. All right, let's uh discover this. The hag's cure. It's good having all these things that you can discover now. And um, sit in the mine. It's good having all these things. You, what is down here? It's good having all these things you can discover now. Um, and it'll be like just to be able to fast travel to them because usually, as I've said in my last, but look at this. Look at this for a, lot, a nice little pocket and mark off. You know what? This is going to be the thumbnail. I'm going to save there. That's going to be the thumbnail. This nice little pocket in Markarth. People won't even know this is in Markarth. Ooh, Creep Cluster. That's uh, that's pretty useful. Let's take some of that. Uh, Creep Cluster, Creep Cluster, Creep Cluster. This is a nice little alchemical spot right here. A great little alchemical spot. Alright. Um, oh, I forgot. I can't even make any potions. So I'm trying to get an achievement for that. Alright, cool. Oh, well. Fine. <laughs> Whatever achievement system, I won't do it. Uh, let's... That's not that. Hall of the Dead. Is that the Hall of the Dead? That is too. Yeah, see, this is what I mean. It's nice just having all these little fast travel points. Um, because things like the Hag's Cure, like, I've never actually bothered to go to. But now that it's there and it's on the map, it'll just kind of be something that, I don't know, I need need the, need the to go to a, an, al an alchemy spot to sell something. Who are you? You don't talk much, do you? Yes. Oh, you do. Can I help you? I guess not. You don't say anything. <laughs> um, yeah, it'll just kind of be nice. It'll just be just a, I don't know, quality of life thing to be able to easily fast travel to it. All right, we're not going to spend... Ooh, maybe we'll spend more time. I do want to see what the Understone Keep looks like. Let's do that. I was going to say we're not going to spend too much more time in Markarth, but maybe we will. Maybe we will. I do want to see the Understone Keep and see what, what changes have been made in there. Quite interested indeed. I love these door animations. It just fits. It just fits so well, especially the Dwemer. the the Dwemer vo the Dwemer door animations fit really well. Just the lever and the cogs, and well, would you look at that? Well, that's certainly different, isn't it? What are you hiding, priest? It's all been cleaned up. Anything. It's closed for a reason. My goodness, it's amazing. Imperial lies. First, you take away talents. Now you're keeping us from seeing our honored dead. Look you at the Yarrow will answer oh, man. any desecration of my ancestors. And look at his staff. Look at that That's for enough. a staff. Just the detail on the staffs. I love them so much. Like you can see all the little parts, and he's not gonna stay still for me, but you can see all the little bits in the ball that floats in there. And I need to start I need to dress you up in robes and I need to start giving you staffs. The only thing is, is every time I give you armor, you change into the armor instead of robes. I, I want you to turn into a more of a magical person with me. Alright, um, look at it. I'm getting torn for what, for what should be the thumbnail. I'm really getting torn for what should be the thumbnail. That's, that's gonna be the best thing about this, uh, this mod list, is I always struggle to find, like, good looking places and making a thumbnail look kind of scenic and interesting, but now there is just no shortage of things. Like, even something as that can pass as a nice thumbnail, just that angle. There's just no shortage of things to use now. Hello, Ondolomar. Ondolomar. It's your obligation to report. Obligation, you say. Search the shrine of Talos. Oh my... Okay. See, stuff like this now. Stuff like this. I can actually search that and then come and report it to him if I want to get rid of people that worship Talos. This is all And I'm a high elf. I might even do it just for roleplay reasons. Why not? Um, you're not from Markarth, I take it? As if this craggy wretch of a city could give birth to a superiorly bred mer such as myself. Oh, yes. No, I'm not from Markarth. I was sent here to lead the Thalmor's interests in this corner of Skyrim. It's my mission to root out all Talos worship in this city. Ah, oh, okay. Why are you after Talos worshippers? It's a religious matter. The Thalmor do not recognize Talos as a god. He was only a man, and does not deserve a place in our pantheon. The Empire has agreed to accept our beliefs, and its citizens have a responsibility to cease their heretical worship. You're awfully inquisitive, aren't you? I like that. Perhaps you'd care to solve a little problem I'm having. Is this a... Yeah, okay, cool. I'm interested. Oldman the Scout. He's old, respected, and I know for a fact that he worships Talos in his home. But the Yarrow has been hesitant to call for his arrest. I want you to break into his home and find evidence. Heck yes! Somebody is going to prison. Okay. <laughs> uh, who are the Thalmor? We're the ruling body of the ordinary dominion. Saviors of Myrrh. Victors of the Great War. 
The Empire exists because we allow it to exist. And I'm here to make sure the Jarl of Markarth remembers that. Awesome, awesome. What do you mean? Okay, so much extra dialogue. Um, Alright, we're going to have to... Alright, that's going to have to do it for today's episode, guys. If you guys are enjoying this playthrough as much as I am, please consider liking, please consider subscribing, and we're going to pick up the next episode midway through this conversation. Uh, but yeah, have a fantastic day. Bye-bye.